A young woman's account of being attacked on the subway is going viral. Luckily, she wasn't seriously hurt, but her story resonating with so many. This native New Yorker says things are changing in the city and not for the better. She spoke tonight with Eyewitness News reporter Lucy Yang. I was looking down, and the next thing I know, I heard a slap. That was last Friday afternoon. When I look up, everybody's staring at me. I look at my cousin, and she's crying. And that's when it sunk in, like, he, this man just hit me. 22-year-old Vesley Beato and her 15-year-old cousin were on the number one uptown train heading home to Inwood. As it pulled into the West 66th Street subway station by Lincoln Center, a man slapped her hard in the face, then ran off. Having to, like, clean up my blood on a train is not something that we had on our agenda. Vesley was wearing glasses, which cut into the bridge of her nose. She's hoping it does not leave a permanent scar. The victim posted about her frightening incident on TikTok. And then I start crying, and I'm like, did I do anything? Like, to deserve this. The video struck a chord with New Yorkers. More than 8,000 comments, many of them from women, describing how they too have been pushed, slashed, punched, attacked. So far this year, there have been 1,488 reported crimes on the subways. Compared with this time last year, 998. That's a jump of 490 incidents. Now, Vesley joins the grim statistic. It's shocking. It's, it's shocking because I never thought that it would happen to me. I feel myself changed after this situation. Vesley, a lifelong New Yorker who works in nonprofit, will have to get on the train again, and that's what worries her. She did not get a good look at the attacker, and now she's wondering if it's time to leave the city.